Hello second graders today with Scott we are going to be heading to Italy so today we head to Italy with Scott so this beautiful picture back here of Ital Italy at, at twilight at dusk time or maybe early in the morning it's a beautiful picture so this page looks very similar to your page that you'll find in your packet, your Globetrot Scott packet. It's very similar. There are a few extra things that I'll show you in just a little bit. Um, so um, I'm not very good at speaking Italian. So we say Merry Christmas in Italian like this. Let's take a listen. Buon Natale. One more time. Buon Natale. Buon Natale. Okay, so Buon Natale means Merry Christmas in Italy. I just arrived in Rome and I'm staying with my friend Gianna. Here she is right here. We are anxiously awaiting for La Bafana. Here is a La Bafana doll to arrive. La Bafana is an old friendly witch who flies around on her broomstick and delivers gifts to children. So La Bafana is the person who is responsible for delivering gifts to the children in Italy. So if we take a look here, Italy has many great sights to see. And this is the Colosseum in Rome. It's a very old place in Rome. And Gianna lives nearby. And remember, it's Bon Natale. Did you know on Christmas Eve, many Italian children dress up as shepherds and walk through the town singing carols? So instead of just going caroling, they dress up as shepherds to sing the carols. Another fun tradition in Italy is that the children will hide a letter in their father's napkin, promising to be good in the new year. Some of you may want to try and do that Italian tradition at Christmas time this year. So hide a note in your father's napkin, telling him that you'll be good for the coming year. And again, we have some La Bafana dolls, and these are things that are for sale in little shops found around Rome. So um, we take a look. At Italy here very beautiful that picture that we started with a very beautiful city a very old city with lots of history so just like our flag from yesterday in France we had red white and blue today our Italian flag is green white and blue so very similar to our French flag yesterday the only difference is that the first color is green instead so when we say hello in Italian, we say ciao. Let's take a listen. Ciao. Okay, one more time. Ciao. Ciao. So we say hello by saying ciao in Italian. Okay, so here's La Bafana. La Bafana is an old kind witch who leaves presents for the children on January 6th. So January 6th is obviously not Christmas, but that is the epiphany. Okay, so La Bafana leaves the gifts for the children on January 6th. And instead of being like Santa Claus and flying with a sleigh driven by reindeer, she flies on her broomstick from house to house. So children at Christmas time in Italy might recite poems or sing songs or spend time with their families during this time. And some of the children dress as shepherds as they sing their carols. So if we take a look here, this must be a live nativity scene in Italy. One tradition celebrated by many Italians is the Feast of the Seven Fishes. People eat many different fishes as a big Christmas Eve meal. So some families, even um, Italian Americans that live here in America, celebrate this tradition. And they do this as part of their family meal. So they have seven different types of fish for their meal. So again, here's the Colosseum in Rome. Very beautiful picture of the Colosseum there in Rome with the sun behind it. And then another picture of some snapshots. Notice how the buildings in Rome look very old and very ancient. Notice that this monument right here kind of looks similar to yesterday with the Arc de Triomphe in Paris. Um, a picture of some homes along the ocean in Italy. Very bright colored homes. That's a very beautiful picture. I would like to visit there 
Okay, so today, what you are going to do in your packet, so today what you're going to do in your packet, when you take a look at your packet and you go to your Italy page, that page that we just, the, the first page for Italy is the page that we went over here on this screen right here. So we already went over your first page, so you don't have to do anything there. We already went through that. On the back side of your paper, you're going to draw the flag for the country of Italy. You're going to write one fact you learned if you want to pause the video or you can either go back to the page before and write a fact from the page before. So one fact you learned and um, you have a couple of questions here and it says what do children hide in their father's napkins? So you might have to go back and reread that page before. Please remember to write in a complete sentence. Children hide blank in their father's napkins. And the last one on that side says, what might you eat while in Italy at Christmas? So remember, there was something special that they eat on Christmas Eve. So draw and label that. And then there is another page for you to do. So it's comparing La Bafana to Santa Claus. So you'll draw a picture of Santa on the left and draw a picture of La Bafana on the right. Remember, La Bafana is a kind old witch who delivers the gifts. And you're going to then write how Santa and La Bafana are the same. And so you'll write Santa and La Bafana are the same because, and then you need to tell me one way they're different. So one way that they're different, okay? Thank you for visiting Italy with me today. I enjoyed our trip to Italy.